Hi, this is Ryan Price with another screencast. It's been a while since I've done one of these. I just want to talk really briefly about Firefox. They've been doing a lot of really cool stuff. Right now, you can download Firefox 5 beta. Most people should have updated to 4. And um, one of the cool things they're doing now is they have a mobile version of Firefox. I've been using it on my Android phone. And um, basically what you do is you open up the app on your phone and it gives you a code. And in order to get to that code, you open up the preferences. So on a Mac, you just push command and comma. Normally you get this general tab or your content tab or whatever it is. But if you go to sync, you can click add a device and it will ask you to type in the code. It's three lines of four letters. Once you do that, all of your bookmarks will be available on your phone and any new bookmarks you add on your phone will be available on Firefox. Your entire browsing history will be available in both places. And if you have more than one computer, you can see what tabs you had open on all of your computers if you have this sync set up. And you can also do this from one computer to another in order to get this all to work. So Mozilla has a service that's just magically working in the background and it will keep track of your bookmarks, your browsing history, your preferences, and you can actually choose here in the sync tab which uh, ones of those things you would like to save, including passwords. And after the very useful Xmarks service stopped publishing their service, this was a really great welcome add-on that's just sort of built into Firefox now. So go ahead and check that out. And if you've got a mobile phone, check out Firefox for mobile. Um, if you want to find out some more screencasts and more interesting things for using the web, you can always go to my blog here, Ryan Price and the media. It's ryanpricemedia.com.